Stand by for the latest episode of the Biz News Flash Briefing. The latest news from the world of business and investments. Critically ill COVID patients in Africa face an outsized risk of death, mainly because health systems lack key resources like hospital beds and oxygen machines. This is according to a report published in the Lancet Medical Journal, which says that the death rate in Africa is about 48%. This compares with about 32% globally in the month after admission to intensive care. The findings are based on a study of 64 hospitals in 10 countries, including South Africa, Ethiopia, Ghana and Mozambique. Cybersecurity company McAfee has warned that an increasingly high number of questionable COVID-19 vaccines and illicit proof of vaccination cards are being sold on the dark web. The Pfizer-BioNTech vaccine sells for about 7,000 rand. One of South Africa's political heroines in the fight against corruption has stepped away from politics. The DA's former Shadow Minister of Communications, Pumzile Van Dam, has resigned as a member of parliament. Among her campaigns, she led the charge against Abel Pottinger's white monopoly capital disinformation and state capture campaign. The cryptocurrency market nursed its wounds on Friday after a week of pain triggered by a Chinese regulatory warning shot, forced selling and a possible US tax clampdown. Hong Kong-based analyst Muneeb Jan told Biz News the regulatory developments are likely to put a lid on cryptocurrency prices. So what China has done is today they have banned cryptocurrencies trading outright. And one reason for that is, of course, capital controls. That's not everything, of course, because China has a credit problem and they're expected to be sitting on a lot of bad loans. So they are they don't, they don't want any risk to their financial system. Those countries concerned about capital control leakage, they may tighten the noose, so to speak. And that was your Biz News Flash Briefing. I'm Jackie Cameron for Biz News. For more on those and the other big stories of the day, do go to biznewsradio.com. You've been listening to the Biz News Flash Briefing, bringing you the latest news from the world of business and investments. Subscribe to Biz News Radio on iTunes, Spotify, Amazon, or by visiting biznews.com.